Hello, everybody, and welcome back to some more Lemmings World Tour! So, we're still on the Rockstar rank. I forgot how long these ranks are, but we're a good ways through. I think we only have ten or so levels left, maybe only nine. And thus far, this rank has been really good. There have been a couple of toughies, but on the whole, it's just been a nice, slightly challenging rank that has made me work my brain a little bit, but they've been very enjoyable bite-sized levels. Ah, yes. We're on level 30 today, losing my religion. Well, I'm not losing my religion, but perhaps the lemmings are. We've got, this is by REM. We've got the Star of David on the left. We've got the Cross of Christianity, uh, the Islam uh, Crescent Moon symbol, and then that there at the end there. It's like a flower. I actually don't particularly recognize that one. Oh, well, the cross is the most important one anyways. <laughs> At least for me. We got 40 lemmings, 39 to be saved, 20 release raid. All right. A lot of platform. All right, we basically have an unlimited amount of platformers. Oof. I keep forgetting how loud the music is in this. Well, I think what we can do... Yeah. We can do a little something like that. Hmm. Okay, interesting. I see how we're going I see how this is going to go. We can send two climbers up here and then they can do a little climb bomb. Yes, just like that. There's no time limit, so we can take as much time as we want. Oh, of course. Should have expected as much. Alright. Okay, I don't like that. But I also don't really see an, a lot of other ways of getting higher than that. Oh boy. Perhaps this could be a bit problematic. We have a good amount of platformers and bashers left, so here's what we're going to do. Okay, we want to go back one, two, three. Okay, we want to do a little something like that, maybe. I'm not sure if that's intended or not. And now we have enough bashers that even if this guy can't bash through in time... But he can. Beautiful! That was a fun one! Nice one! Okay, that was fun! Very easy. Like, very easy. Definitely uh, one of the easiest Rockstar levels I've played thus far. It was... I didn't really have to think on that one a whole lot. Maybe it's just because I know all of the tricks, like for that that was were needed for that level inside and out. But that one definitely seemed like a bit of a breather compared to the other Rockstar levels. Even the other ones that were fairly easy. That one just it seemed like the path was just so clear. Maybe that was just me though. Level thirty one, Cold Turkey by John Lennon. <laughs> oh, the pun! I love it. I love it. 
It, we're quitting cold turkey, and we are literally in cold turkey. That's that's fantastic. All right, 40 lemmings. We can afford to kill one of them. 30 release rate. Yeah, I know that's not what this song is actually about, but whatever. No, it's brilliant. <laughs> okay, we got more of these here. These posts. We got free cloners and free bombers. Interesting. Okay, where's the exit? Oh, the exit's way over there, and we actually have to bash for it. Okay, well, I'm, you know what, folks? I'm guessing we're going to have to find a way over here, dig, bash, and clone. So here's a question. So that's obviously still splat height, but if we do a second one of these... There we go! <laughs> Easy peasy. Okay. Well, again, you know me, I like trying stuff. Until I can get something to work. That's too high. Hmm. Is that too high? Yeah, that is too high. What am I worried about? We basically have an unlimited amount of bashers. Oh wait, we don't have... Oh wait, that's those are one-way arrows. I thought that would stop the digger. It would not. Okay, we are going to need to save one of those bashers for the end. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to clone. And we're going to blow him up. Unless I'm missing something, this seems really easy. Perhaps I'm missing something. Anyhow, now what we're going to do is we're going to bash. Or dig and bash. Okay. Gonna bash from there, and then we're gonna clone him. Sure enough, now we can clone him. Oh wait, I used every skill and we're gonna save every- Oh. Okay, that is exactly as intended then. That was also really easy for the Rockstar rank, holy cow. Again, maybe I just got lucky and happened to see the solution right away, but wow, I did not even have to think about that one. I thought that was I thought I was about to backroot that because I was sure that I was saving more lemmings than were required, but nope, apparently not. Actually, no, that makes sense because we we could afford to kill one lemming, and we were able to clone free extra ones and blow up those free extra one oh, those free extra ones, and then the basher fled off the cliff. So no, that, I think that was exactly as intended. Cool. I like backrooting, but at the same time, there's something satisfying about finding what's likely the intended solution. It makes you, it makes, especially that quickly, it makes you feel a little smart. Level 32, Angel by Ramstein. All right, we can afford to kill five, kill five lemmings here. Haven't we had a level like this before? Also, that's not how you spell angel. <laughs> it's just like one of those internet meme things, like Doge, or like it's a doggo. It's, it, it's a dog. Okay, like, just just stop it already. Okay, it's a sky level. I like the angel out of uh, terrain. I'm pretty sure I've seen that before in my the first half of my Let's Play, but maybe, maybe I'm mistaken about that. At the very least, I've seen this somewhere before. Okay. <laughs> nice tile set mixing here. It is, it's very nice. Alright, what's the best... Well, we've got basically an unlimited amount of builders. So I'm just going to start by finding out the ideal place to build from. Ideally, I want to build from a place... Oh, wait a second. We don't have bashers. Why did I think we had bashers? Okay. Well, 
It's pretty clear we need to use the digger tunnel in order to... I did not say to zoom in. I don't know what was up with that. Oh, wait. Oh, we can just seal them in right away. That's actually great. Just like Tony the Tiger said. No, 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 no. Okay, there we go. Now they're all trapped in. Oh, I see the issue. Okay, we actually... we No, we can't use the stoner there. We, we need to fence up this. Okay, I, I see the issue now. Because we need to um, save the stoner for the end there. Oh, wait. What am I doing? We don't need to dig for that. We can send a floater! Actually, wait, no. Actually, wait, yes. We're going to send a floater, and we're going to send a digger. <laughs> this is big brain time. Oh, beautiful. Yes. Just like that. Just like that. And now we can have this guy build a platform. Okay. Let's try that. That's what we need the stoner for. Because the hitbox for that exit is pretty low. Yippee. Just like that. And now I think we can just get them out with a single builder. No, we can't. Okay. I could have if I had stopped the digger a little earlier. But that's okay. We still have skills to spare. <laughs> Yippee! And we saved way more than needed. So maybe that's a slight back route? Probably. I, I Generally in the later ranks, if you finish with skills to spare and or saved extra lemmings, unless it's very clearly an open-ended level, like it, it's pretty safe to assume you at least minorly backrooted it, which, hey, that's what I strive for when I play lemmings packs. They don't call me the backroot conductor for nothing. Choo-choo! Level 33, St. Elmo's Fire by John Parr. Ah, Elmo, don't remember setting a fire on this boat. <laughs> oh, this is a sweet looking boat. I love it. It's fantastic. All right, we can afford to kill five lemmings on this one. Ooh. Oh, man, this, this ship puts my pirate ship level to shame. Also, there are lasers coming out of the top. Don't think I didn't see those. Those are lasers. Okay. Huh. Hmm. Well, this just got interesting. I was thinking right off the bat, I'm like, we could do like a dig down here, and then we could mine and then bash through all of this. And I mean, actually, we now. I feel like I I feel like that might be possible, but it would be way harder than what's likely the intended solution. Which I'm guessing the intended solution is you build block, build bash platform, bash platform fence pl uh, platform build. All right. Boom. 
Ding 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 ding. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Hopefully, we have enough constructive skills to get us through this. That's not good. We're running low on builders already. one where it's just going to be hard to figure out just because of the terrain. Our skill set is really not all that limited, so... Try my backrootish hackish solution. See if I can get that to work. Dude, I told you to dig. something like this. Oh my gosh, we can. <laughs> this is... Oh, yes. This is so dumb, but also fantastic. Oh, wait. Shoot. We kind of need the blocker for this up here. forgot about that. Hmm. That is a pity. Okay, so we can't do that. I don't like how the one-way arrows are just high enough that you can't get through them, even with a fencer. Like, really? Why would you do that? Got fruit without needing to use our our blocker. That doesn't leave us a whole lot of tools left, but
Alright, so if we do that, we can get these lemmings out just by a uh, platforming, which is nice. So, with that... If I ask nicely, can we get up here with one builder? Yay! Oh, this is good. Please get up there in one builder. Oh yeah! Actually, folks, that might be an intended solution! <laughs> we save exactly enough! We have a basher to spare, which is interesting. That is interesting! We have ex we saved exactly enough with a basher left over. I'm gonna call that intended! <laughs> I don't know if it actually is or not, but. Man, we are ripping for the levels. I love that one. I, any level that involves a pirate ship, I'm probably going to like it. I admit, again, I kind of wish that the one-way arrows were maybe a little bit higher as well, just to make it more obvious that if you get to the top of the sail, you can't fence up it, because it really looked like you would have been able to. Oh, but that's a pretty minor complaint. That was a fun level. Now, I have been told... That level 34 of the Rockstar rank is actually not appropriate for my channel. And I've taken a look at it, and... Yeah, basically the scenery is designed in such a way that it's supposed to be something very inappropriate. I... It was one of those things where I'm like, yeah, I probably don't want to put this on my channel. And before you even say, but Artie, you're playing Fruit of Grisse on your channel, which is rated M, so, like, what's up with that? Yeah, but the difference is Fruit of Grisse is a game that the game is inherently rated M. Thus, every single episode in that series, I can put the viewer discretion advised warning on, and then people who aren't old enough to watch can just stay away from the entire uh, playlist. Whereas Lemmings is a game that was made for all ages, and if there's just one level that's inappropriate, then sucks to be me, I guess. So I will be skipping this level. I've been told by Strato that's perfectly fine if I skip it, and if you really want to experience it, you can play the pack for yourself. <laughs> you can download it at lemmingsforums.net and look under level packs for Neolemics. Anyhow, next up is Rockstar level 25. 35. Level 35, South of Heaven by Slayer! We gotta save all 40 of them. Oh boy, it's another cloud level, and this one looks a lot nastier. There's very little terrain. Actually, this terrain is kind of similar to my Bridgeworks level, but mine was more simplistic. 60 release rate, eh? Oh, boy. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. This is Bridgeworks. This is literally Bridgeworks. Copycat. All right. We're going to dig here. Okay. No, we're not going to dig there. How come you escaped that time? So for those of you who don't know, my I have a level pack called Sublems, where there's a level very similar to this, where you have to build to the exit that's right above you, and there are no blockers. So we can start turning lemmings around like so. I'll build I'll build up farther first. 
So as soon as we lay that down, we can dig and then build into this little pixel here. Turn around like this. So now what we need to do is we need to build a bridge wall all the way up here to turn lemmings around. Which is definitely a trick that most levels do not require of you. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh, I didn't I didn't fry up. Alright, that should do it. That should be sufficient for a bridge wall. And now everyone should hit their heads and turn around. Boom! Ha ha da da da. That's actually trickier than my bridge works level. That's actually trickier than my bridge works level, because on bridge works you have a little bit more room to work with. You also have a couple more skills. And you can afford to lose a couple of lemmings. You don't actually have to <laughs> dig at that precise moment while building to hit a pixel. You could just send a lemming ahead, have him fall off, and then send a lemming. You can the lemmings are just naturally trapped in a pit that you can have them climb out of. All right, a little bit of a rip off of my level, but that's perfectly fine by me. I'll I consider that flattery. And hey, if you came up with that solution all on your own, then hey, even more props to you. Nice sky level. All right. I do not have the confidence that I can complete the next level within like two or three minutes. So I guess we'll have a slightly shorter episode than usual for today. That's going to do it for this episode of Lemmings World Tour. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. I'm Colorful Artie. Tune in next time. With the rate we're going, we only have five Rockstar levels left. We might be able to finish them all next episode. I'm not going to promise you that because who knows, we might have a, tri a really tricky one coming up. And <laughs> as we all know, I can get stuck on even remarkably simple levels for very, a very long time just by overthinking things. Then again, today's levels, they were all very fun and very easy. So maybe we'll get five more fun, easy levels next time. I would love that. Look forward to that next time. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day and God bless.